Wait a second, before we start this video off, there's a traveling merchant, let me get that real quick. And yeah guys, I actually did a lot of off-camera grinding pretty much. Well, not really off-camera grinding, but I was sitting inside that little machine over there for uh, maybe about like 30-something hours. And we actually ended up getting somewhere around like 4k, I don't remember exactly. But we were able to pull a bunch of new legendaries, like this Jio, Geo, however you say them. And then we also got this guy, which is also pretty good. But now, the only problem is I don't have enough inventory to equip like the legendaries, but I need this speed cart because that's going to help me level up all my fighters like faster especially because of the fact that they cost so much since they're legendaries so pretty much guys what the goal is is i'm trying to grind a level 50 maybe not in this video of course because that's gonna take like a while but i definitely want to unlock an extra spot and actually you know what? we do have an extra ticket so why not just open this real quick and let's see what we could get and we got a uh, rare okay well but yeah after our last video of actually pulling blackbeard i did get him a little bit better too which is amazing and i did actually roll a nimble three on him so he attacks fast but now the true goal of this video is to actually clear all these worlds and a lot of you guys have been asking me like how are you level 26 but you only unlocked two worlds and that's because i was pretty much just afk grinding the infinite mode we're well, not really afk because of course you said you know place down your units and stuff but i was trying out a bunch of different stuff on my tiny task and trying to figure out which one works the best and i found a method but it doesn't exactly work 100 percent of the time so i just figured you know i guess you know it's just a game that you have to grind yourself but yeah that's fine and pretty much we probably beat this infinite mode at least like 30 times so yeah now the goal is to actually clear out all of these you know worlds and also also guys let me know in the comments because this is a question that i've been wanting to ask for a while but i just never thought it would be important but guys when it comes to infinite mode do you get more gems the higher you go up like for instance if i were to do an infinite mode in the hidden sand village do i get more from there than you know planet namek let me know in the comments because i figure you do but again i'm not exactly sure because of course i can't unlock this infinite to even check if it goes up but i'm assuming you do because you know that just makes more sense and yeah guys i guess i'll start my grind okay guys so we were doing a bunch of infinite modes mostly to grind gems and to grind some xp for my fighters so we didn't quite get to the best world yet but i am planning to do that in this video but you know i just need to get more gems because i really want to get this mythic right here because apparently it's really really good so i'm gonna try to get it and if i can't you know i can't but let's see what happens here i'm just gonna keep max opening and let's see what we can get I literally just had my auto open on buy 10 so let's see what we got here first of all items well okay we have four star remnants not bad and then the units we have oh my goodness we actually got it finally all right we got our first mythical and it's brulo i think he's like one of the best too which is really really good so what am i gonna equip him for that's actually a really really good question all of my fighters are really really good i would replace him with this dabble but the thing is my dabble is like extremely good now and speed card is also really good because it really gives you like a bunch again and then blackbeard is like kind of good but his attack speed is really really good i think it goes down to like 5.1 or 4 point something i think it's like 4.8 speed card is really really good but the thing is i just need those extra fighters so here oh this guy's doing an infinite mode let me hop in this real quick let me hop in this real quick all right i can help this guy out at the same time so let's pretty much just do this and i really want to check out this new mythical oh shoot i meant to roll my uh my little passive thingies my traits i forgot about that dang it yeah i gotta roll that this guy not gonna start it bro this guy literally just got disconnected so i guess it's only me here which is kind of unfortunate i really wanted to do this with other people especially because the fact that i don't have farms uh yeah let's put down this guy now since you know why not oh my goodness he has a splash damage and he does 111 damage at the start that's crazy yeah so this fighter is pretty good I'm not gonna lie to you the only thing is this attack speed is really really slow um but other than that he seems pretty good so yeah guys i'll come back once we get to like wave 40 or something maybe even 45 maybe even 50 and let's see how hard it is or easy it is with this new fighter i mean just look how cool he looks though but yeah we're actually about to die so i don't know what i'm doing right now holy moly we're actually about to die okay thank goodness he covered that yeah i almost just died i wasn't even paying attention i literally don't understand why i keep lagging out of these games but it's all good so let's pick up this guy uh use oh wait, you gotta unequip him first dang it unequip and now let's pick up some traits oh my goodness we need five of these shards okay never mind then but now something we could actually do is evolve it so let's come over here let's see what evolve means so which one of these items do i use for this mythical i'm honestly not sure which one it is out of conquer and i don't think so i think this one would be shanks right okay so i actually figured out which one it is it's actually this one right here the restraining necklace that i need so i need a few items here that i don't have so it's gonna take a while to get those but yeah we actually have 3,000 gems i've been grinding this game for like two days about and there is actually an update let's check the update log so new challenges new raids so pretty much they just added raids in this update and a few new fighters from the raids and they kind of buffed the infinite mode when it comes to you know how long it takes to do each round and how much gems you get so that's pretty good honestly let me get this you know summon ticket right here 
there. Nice. And now let's try to get Whitebeard. Or do I try to get Whitebeard? Because right now I have a mythical already. So is it really worth it to try to get another mythical? Or should I just save it? Honestly, you know what? No, I'm not going to roll that. Let's go check out the raid. Because I'm not sure exactly when the raid starts. Oh my goodness. What the? Okay. Wow. That's like an hour and 30 minutes. So yeah, I have a long time to wait for this raid, unfortunately. So that's actually crazy. Well, guys, in that case, let me just buy this stuff right here in the shop over here. And now we should have five uh, fragments or whatever you call it. Star remnant thingies. Yeah, we have five of them. So we could come over here and actually roll a trait on our new mythical. So let's put them in here. Oh, I got an equipment first. Bam. And we have five of them. So let's hope we get something good here. Come on. Range one. I mean, that's not, that's not, that's pretty bad, honestly. I'm not gonna lie to you, but I'll take it. And also we can actually level him up. So let's, uh, let's use, let's feed all of this into him. And yay, he only goes up three levels. That's amazing. Oh, brother. All right, whatever. I have to stop doing infinite modes in like the lower tier levels because I'm not getting a lot of good fruits. But yeah, I think I'm just gonna start saving my gems up now at this point because since I already have a mythical, I feel like I should just, you know, be kind of smart with what I'm spending. So now, guys, I'm gonna get back to farming the worlds and let's see if we can finish it. All right, so it's been about four days since I actually got my mythical and a lot has happened, a lot has changed. I have been doing my raids and my challenges and stuff like that. That's why we have 8K gems. And honestly, I wish I could actually craft a unit right now, but I'm not trying to wait a whole hour to actually do a raid or to actually go into the raid thingy. So pretty much, guys, I've been grinding like crazy. As you can see, my fighters are like really high levels and stuff like that. And I pretty much just been doing challenges and raids to get my, you know, gems up and stuff like that. I really haven't been doing the normal stuff, mostly because it doesn't give a lot of gems. And it's just kind of boring because, you know, it could kind of be soloed and I kind of just want to play with people. And yeah, I may actually do a live stream where I just invite a bunch of you to a private server or something like that. And we could kind of just play this game for a few hours. I don't know. And uh, yeah, these people are like really, really high levels. It's actually crazy. I'm sure some of these people are hackers, but like, I don't want to accuse anyone of hacking. But uh, if you're on here and you're not hacking, you know, congrats, because you know, that's a huge accomplishment. I'm not gonna lie to you. But yeah, we are actually level 37 and it does actually take me 10 infinite modes to actually level up. So, you know, that's crazy. But yeah, my plans for my next video, honestly, is to actually get this, where is it at? Restraining necklace for my Brulo. That way, you know, I can make him a shiny. My problem is getting these fruits is really hard, especially this one, plenty 35. But these two, I have never seen in the shop, the merchants. So I don't even know how to get these, but uh, I'm sure I'll eventually learn how to get those. But yeah, right now that's where we're at in this game, guys. And yeah, with our new Brulo being level 43, it does a lot more damage now. It's actually really, really good. I stopped using black hair because I wanted to put a speed card in. But the only problem is I only use speed card for like infinite modes. Well, not infinite modes, but raids because I actually just did a raid. And then Bomi would be like my main unit instead of speed card because they're both farms. And yeah, that's pretty much it. I think we did a lot in this video, probably more than I should have. I probably should have made this more parts. And yeah, if you guys haven't already, make sure to like button and subscribe so you don't miss a video like this. And I will see you all in my next video. Also, let me know what you guys think this would be. I'm hoping that it's something we can use gems on because I do want to use a bunch of my gems or even my money. But I think that's kind of what raids are for now for the money because you can just get raid tickets. But uh, I am curious what this is. And yeah, let me know what level you guys are in this game because I want to know how I compare even though I started this game a little late. So let me know. And yeah, peace.